Earlier this year, I showed you every single way that you can use Samsung DeX. Today, I am bringing you the ultimate Samsung DeX accessory that you can bring with you anywhere you go so you can be productive right from your smartphone. Let's go. Earlier this year, Espresso Display reached out to me about their portable monitors. They're so incredibly thin and light and can be taken anywhere. When I got wind of this product and what they offer, a light bulb went on in my head. What about using this for Samsung DeX, creating the ultimate portable workstation anywhere I go? In October, they announced the Espresso 17 Pro. And after having spent some time with it in the last couple of days, I think this display is tailor-made to be used with Samsung DeX. Before we look at how Samsung DeX and this display are a match made in heaven, let's take a bit of a look at the display itself and the features that make up what this can offer you. First things first, like the other one that I've got, the Espresso 17 Pro is packaged expertly. Props to Espresso Display for how they put care and attention to detail in the unboxing experience. It is so pleasant and gives you the best experience possible when you first want to get your hands on it. I have the entire Pro kit with me. I have the Pro stand, I have the, the pen, I have the display itself, and I have most importantly for this setup, the Espresso Charge which is a 32,000 milliamp hour battery pack, which we'll get to in a moment. The display itself is pro in every sense of the word. First things first, it's now 4K in its resolution, upping it from the full HD from the Espresso Touch 15. That difference is immeasurably noticeable when you start using the 7.3 inch panel on the 17 Pro. For me and my workflows, having a 4K monitor with 10 bit colors just means I'm going to be able to precisely edit my videos and create with a lot more freedom because the detail and the resolution and the colors are accurate for me to work from. It has a peak brightness of 450 nits, which on camera outdoors, it didn't capture it well, but honestly it is bright enough. And when you see it in person, it will more than be capable for being and working outdoors, extending the portable productivity that it can offer. Its design profile is remarkably thin for a device of this size, and it's incredibly light for what it can actually offer you. It has bottom firing speakers, which aren't necessary, but it is nice to have in a pinch. Have a listen to what they sound like. Then pass the information over to the device's rightful owner. You do have to opt in. But most importantly, it has on the right-hand side two USB-C ports, which is definitely most crucial to how this operates and functions. Of those two ports, one of them gets taken up by the device that you're inputting and wanting to be displayed on the screen. The other is available for power input. Now you can plug in a, a charger, a USB-C device, and that will charge your device that you're using as well, but that kind of defeats the purpose of portability that this portable monitor is meant to be offering you. With the right device, the Espresso display will actually just draw power from the host to power it, say power more, and meaning that you don't need any external battery or external power to activate it. The right device being laptops mostly, for example, or probably gaming consoles as well. But for the purposes of what I'm showing you, Samsung DeX, the Espresso Charge is crucial. This 32,000 milliamp hour battery pack is what will enable the crisp, bright, portable DeX experience that you want out of a portable monitor like this. The smart thing with this battery pack, it doesn't need to be fixed to the back of the device or housed internally. Espresso have built this to basically act as part of the stand. It is so clever with what they've done here. When you put this down at the bottom, the actual Stand Pro will magnet to the top of this quite robustly. So you don't have to worry about it toppling over once these two devices are connected. The Stand Pro, I feel, is a critical part of this setup. It's so neat having something like this that folds up effectively flat and can also be propped up and positioned at multiple angles. Espresso have also built in this neat little flap, I want to call it. It's purple in color, so you can you can see it draws your attention, and it can actually hold the display at this this nice low angle. I find that's probably going to work really well for creative professionals who draw a lot and work a lot in apps that require art. Not me, it's not really my thing, but it's great that it's there. All of these upgrades for the Pro pretty much make it the perfect accompaniment to Samsung DeX. And let's show you why. A large part of the Samsung DeX experience is its ability to be portable to be an on-the-go machine that fits in your pocket. 
Let's look at the various ways that you can use Samsung DeX alongside this 4K beauty. With the 15 inch espresso display, you could actually use this without needing extra power. Because it was full HD, it didn't require as much power as what the 4K monitor does. There was a caveat though. You had to have the brightness level of the monitor set below 50%, which if you didn't know that, it could be a bit of an issue because you had to plug it in and it would just flash the logo trying to power it. If you exclusively used it for DeX, it's not too much of an issue. However, if you swap between DeX and your Windows environment, it can kind of muddy the waters a little bit and create a bit of a, a friction that you potentially don't want to have. What is great with the 17 Pro is that issue just disappears. Because of the charge that you can purchase, the, the battery pack, it effectively creates power that you can take with you anywhere you go. With the battery plugged into the second USB-C port on the display, once you plug in the other cable into Samsung DeX, it launches on the display pretty much immediately. And you can start to see exactly how well this thing runs on it. What's neat too is the phone actually gets charged at the same time as the display is powered. Which I think is a really clever thing to happen. You don't have to worry about your phone losing power because it actually won't. It'll gain battery as time goes on. The clever thing about the battery with the Espresso Charge too is it's got battery light indicators on the back. So if you wanted to, to figure out how much you're using, you can just simply tap the top of the battery pack and it'll indicate the lights and give you a bit of an understanding of how much is left. Once you have DeX open, you can immediately see the difference in the resolution and the clarity from the Espresso 17 to Espresso 15. It's night and day, and I really appreciate working in the DeX environment on a portable monitor like this. But just because you've got the impressive resolution doesn't mean DeX is operating at 4K, but there is a way you can do it. Samsung DeX has some tricks up its sleeve through Samsung's GoodLock modules. GoodLock is my favorite Samsung made customization app. It's through the Galaxy Store. I do have a whole video on GoodLock. Feel free to go and check that out. Inside the multi-star module in the life up section, you have what is called I Love Samsung DeX. Now it's some really handy toggles that you can enable in here. Things like being able to open more than five apps at once when you're connected to an external monitor. That sort of stuff is neat and definitely adds to the DeX experience. The one I really want to set my eyes on here though is high resolution for external displays. Because I am now working on a 4K monitor, I can actually enable high resolution here and it'll make it 4K on the monitor. Now being a good lock module, it doesn't mean it's part of the full One UI system. However, it's capable. Turn that on and restart DeX and you'll be able to see the difference immediately. What you do notice is that things are a lot smaller because it is scaling them out to such a high degree, but you notice the detail and the resolution difference immediately. Things like watching videos become crisper, looking at photos become a lot nicer, and it's just a better experience for Samsung DeX, especially if you're someone who wants to do a bit of work. Whether that be doing some video editing using Samsung's new Galaxy Studio, or whether you are working on photos or going through a photo album after you've just returned from a holiday, it is perfect for that. Being a touchscreen, the Espresso 17 Pro also lends itself to DeX nicely because it creates that more natural interaction. We know how to interact with phones via touch, so having a touchscreen on the DeX environment just means that we don't have to stress too much over how we interact with it. Now, of course, any monitor and desktop sort of experience works best when you have a keyboard and a mouse attached to it. So Samsung DeX is no different. You can, of course, use the screen on the S23 Ultra or the screen that you're using DeX from as your keyboard and your mouse. It will bring up the touchpad and when you click in a text field, it'll bring up the keyboard. But obviously having the keyboard is much better and much easier. You can type in Samsung Notes in web browsers, just gives you that more fluid desktop feel about it. I'm using the Smart Keyboard Trio 500, I think Samsung call it. It has a dedicated DeX button, which definitely adds to the DeX experience, and it's definitely built for this type of thing. Worth checking out. I'll leave a link for it in the description. Another device that can be seamlessly integrated into this Samsung DeX setup is the Tabis 9 Ultra. Especially if you have the keyboard cover like I do, it gives you a laptop replacement in the Tabis 9 Ultra. And 
plugging in the Espresso 17 Pro, you have a multiple monitor setup because you can have the DeX environment on the display and One UI running on your tablet. And DeX is smart in that it allows you to drag the mouse between the two environments. So you can interact with both the, the tablet screen and the monitor at the same time and operate them both using the keyboard from the Tablet Line Ultra. The Tablet Line Ultra also gets the Good Lock module, but I do believe it can run high resolution displays natively. You can see in the DeX settings, on the Tablet Line Ultra, you can change the resolution and there is support for the ultra wide monitors, which you can set here on the Espresso 17 Pro. The only thing is you do get the black bars top and bottom. So it's up to you whether you like that or not, or whether you just prefer to keep it at the 16 by nine, but it's there. The beauty of it is you get two high resolution displays to work from and both of them fit quite comfortably in the same backpack together. So you can take this with you anywhere you go. If you watched my earlier DeX video, the last way you can integrate DeX and this monitor is through DeX for PC. Now in my last Samsung DeX video, I showcased how you can use DeX for PC and how it works. So I'm not gonna go too deep into that again. We know you can use it via cable and we can know you can connect to it wireless, which is my preferred method. What I really like here again with the monitor is that you just get a bigger display to run DeX on. So you can put DeX onto the monitor and leave your laptop running on your laptop screen. And again, you've got control of your phone and control of your laptop using the keyboard and trackpad from your laptop that you've got plugged in. The good thing with the laptop too is it doesn't need the battery pack. It can power the monitor by itself. But what's also neat, if you do decide to plug the battery pack into the monitor, it will charge the, the laptop at the same time. Neat. Overall, this solution almost feels bespokely built for Samsung DeX. A portable monitor with a seamlessly designed battery pack that will charge your phone and run DeX in high resolution. That's like the whole origin point of DeX was almost building to something like this existing. For those that want to isolate and use just your Samsung device, whether it be your phone or your tablet, this is the accessory that you need to make that happen. The best thing is all the accessories that you can get separately consolidate into your bag. So the monitor fits really nicely in the laptop sleeve and the battery pack and the stand fit comfortably into other sections of your bag because of the fact they're so compact and fold up flat. Now what I do here before I've even uploaded this video is a lot of you might suggest, why not just buy a laptop instead? Well, I think that kind of defeats the purpose of what people might want to get out of Samsung DeX. DeX is about being on the move taking your work with you from one location to the next and using the device that's always on you, your phone, to be your production device, the thing that you get everything done on. And you just float and hook into whatever's available at the time. The Espresso display is the device that you take with you so you can hook into what you have rather than relying on what's around you, allowing you to set up with a bigger screen no matter where you are, no matter where you want to go. All from the device that can comfortably fit in your pocket. It's quite, quite clever. If you like the Espresso 17 Pro and the accessories that come with it, use the link in the description. Honestly, if you love DeX and you love portability, this is the, the perfect accessory and it complements it really, really nicely. But that's it for this video. Thank you to Espresso Display for their support in helping me get this video out. They've been really supportive of the channel pretty much near the start and I really appreciate it. If you like my Samsung content, please consider subscribing. I'm just about to cross over to 20K, or if not already have, but at the time of recording, I'm not too far away from it. Between now and my next video, you can come and find me on my socials, Twitter slash X, and also on Instagram. I'll see you guys in the next one. You!